series and where YouTube has or not, but Bronze Ball, All Stars, uh, but again, even more in depth. And uh, before it was just really random, and guys I, I ended up keeping and really building up and hit other levels, hitting into silver quality overall. See ya from Uruguay. He was a 74 overall bronze. In this game, tw past 2019, you can find him. He's an 81 overall gold. Paper. Great, great forward. And it's great all-around game. So I totally recommend him. I'm definitely going to be trying to pick him up. But this year, we're getting very precise. And I will be going in depth in future videos and my top five in each position maybe you want to do the same i definitely have fun with the bronze ball squad i uh, definitely have fun with the silvers as well and and gold and, and black you know the elite players it's always fun to have a, your elite team but we're starting with our this is our second pickup Guillermo. And this is why we picked him. So, I mean, this is how, this is one way of getting him. This isn't the only way, but I'm a little impatient. So, we're going after his club, Yeni Montayaspor. Right wing forward. And I went after ball control. That's because I'm a little impatient right now. I really just want to get this team put together as fast as possible. <clears throat> now, there was a situation where there's another right wing forward. As when we remove this, this guy. And you're going to see why we got to distinguish him, right? And the easiest way would have been to keep playing, pick up um, Diaz from Senegal, Scout. Okay, that would have been another way. Uh, another Or really going again too specific Brazil but we all know that getting a Brazil scout is not the easiest thing and I really don't want to be spending that GP so there are different ways of picking him up um, the other most easiest probably too if you notice his foot Guillermo Guillermo is left footed Diaz right footed that would have been another easy way but I would, I just went with what I got. I said, what do I have in my scout inventory? And this is another, this is something you want to do before you even like start looking at that. As you're comparing, this is some tips. There's some things I learned. I don't like this view. I like this other view better. Um, <clears throat> I like to look at their stats. So you could either do this. This is another way, but we'll talk about that later. Uh, look at these stats, right? You know, you want to look at the any greens. Now, you see Diaz got explosive power at 80. So, you, you'd want to focus on that if you were trying to pick him up. But if you want to focus on Guillermo, Guillermo, I noticed his dribbling was 82. And, you know, Diaz isn't terrible, but Guillermo pops out. So like, well, let's 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 go after that uh, dribbling. Let's find something related to that. So went through the scouts that I do have. I do have an age one. Oh, that's five stars. I'm not necessarily trying to use that. I, I will if I have to. If I really like that player, <laughs> and I decided to go with ball control. I'll see what happened, and boom. So. Play around with it sometimes. Looking at comparing players' uh, skill traits, their stats too. You know, sometimes it gets difficult because there's a lot of similarities when you're trying to narrow it down to exactly the guy you want. All right, so now we're going to get into, and you see it, 100% bronze, and the only target is Guillerme. So I'm excited. This is awesome. Um, but let's look at Guillermo. Why did I pick him as a right wing forward um, from Brazil? So 
But you just look at his overall stats, what he brings on the wing, good speed. It's not the greatest of speed because on the wing you definitely want your speedsters, but it's not terrible. Uh, this dribbling and passing is very, very good. Um, his shooting is all right. You know, he can actually do, do his little bit in the game. If he gets the bump and run, then he can actually hold his own a bit. Uh, for being a winger, that's actually not bad. Um, so, he's 27, so he's still got a good age. And his play style is prolific winger. Alright, so let's take a look. Because that's a pretty good, like we said, was dribbling is pretty, is, is top right stat there for him. And you'll see some other things. Alright. And we see, he's definitely got very good uh very good with both feet but he's left footed so this is really awesome in terms of the right winger because if he do cut in and if he does make some runs from the wings he's going to be very able to get some decent looks and decent shots on goal and i'm saying that he's you're going to be wanting to hit from distance all the time but as is possible his playing styles is under the computer, especially for my gameplay. I like to spread the ball. I like to switch switch it up. Look at his player skills, guys. Seven. Seven player skills. He's bronze. Seven skills. He's the most skilled guy. I, that was the biggest thing for me, why I chose him over others. But there are others that are just as good and viable options, especially depending on what you're to... Do. So, look at this. We got double touch. We got sombrero. We got step on skill control. We got heel trick, malicia, track back, and fighting spirit. I really like what I'm seeing from this guy. He's not just a trickster. That You know what? He's got some other qualities that's going to help in the team play. So, so let's get this guy now, right? Let's. let's this, is, this is the view I, I love the most. You know, you got a little close up. Maybe you just woke up. Right? Looks really relaxed. Let's get this guy now. We know what we're getting. So this is how you properly use your scouts, guys. Save up your scouts. Save them up, save them up, save them up. And, and then when you really want somebody, you're going to be in a situation to get them. All right, so let's get this guy 100%. Here we go. This is what it's like if you've never done this before, and this is what it's supposed to be, uh, really. And pay attention to this. When we're signing him, he's gonna be, he's not gonna be at 74, guys. When he reaches level 30, he will be at a 74 overall. He's gonna, we're gonna build him up from level one. You gotta understand that going in, but that's that's part of the fun. I honestly do enjoy leveling up these guys and seeing them grow. And here we go. Romalatia. Here it is. Yeni Malatia Spor. So that's his club team. I'm pretty excited. And look at the positions he can play. Left mid, right mid, attacking mid, second striker, and right wing forward. Uh, his secondary positions are center forward, center mid, defensive mid, and left fullback. <laughs> so, definitely versatile in the in regard of he can play a lot of different positions on the field. So, that's always nice to look. Have this is my squad at the moment. It won't be forever. But, uh, there we go. We know what we got. We went after it. We got it. We're excited. Super excited. So, thumbs up. We got Guillerme. This is my second guy. This is our second player in our bronze ball all stars. And he's been added to our club. Awesome. So, thank you so much. For joining me today and we will we post another video soon